Hi there, it's Malone. Today we are going to go back to the Not So Berry Challenge. So the last time we were here, I introduced you to the family um, and showed you around their house. Why there's always dirty plates outside of this house is beyond me, but there you go. Um, I introduced you to everyone. I've made a few changes since the last time. So I've downloaded so, some um, new custom content, which you can see on Ruby here. Um, her room has now moved upstairs so Radley's moved out he's in a smaller house nearby the room that Ruby was in is now a gym so that is this room in here so they already had the treadmill and the yoga mat but they were outside and I wanted them to be able to use it when it wasn't terrible weather like it is just now so they now have this little room that they can come into and they have one of the little meditation stools as well and if we pop upstairs, this is Radley's old room, which is now Ruby's room. So this is my favourite bed in the game, so I'm glad it came in a swatch that's red. I've decorated it red, but not as red as it was before. So I'm thinking, actually, I might get rid of this. I think this might be too many paintings that are that size right next to each other. So let me get rid of that. Um... War wallpaper wise her old room was all pure red so i've switched it for these little red polka dots which i thought was cute and that's on two walls in her room so she has like two feature walls she has the same pictures she had before but i've added these custom content ones that i loved um her computer i'm sure she had did she have one before i don't think she did so she now has a computer of her own um and she's got our wardrobe and stuff in here as well I'm, I kind of want to get a TV in here somewhere, but maybe we'll move things around once she's used to that room. Um, so what we need to focus on is Stevie's career. So I'm sure she only has two levels, right? Yeah, she's level eight. She's done her breakthroughs and she's got um, excellent career performance. So I'm thinking the next time she goes to work, she's going to be at level nine and we're not going to be too far away. So for tonight, all I'll do is just get their needs up and stuff. I think I've added some custom content for Ruby's cold weather wear. I don't think I added anything else, but let's have a look. So I added this coat. Um, I downloaded this coat and I thought it looked so cosy. So I've just put it on her with some tights. Now I did find um, custom content, like a remesh of these boots. That I want to try but I noticed okay no they're fine I noticed there's a version that needs a slider and it doesn't appear to work even though I downloaded it with the slider but they're like high heeled versions of my favorite boots which I thought were super cute and they come in three different lengths so I think I kind of like the long ones for her so I'm going to change that I'm sure I didn't change anything else um oh I did I added this outfit as well so these are some new boots I downloaded, the rest I'm sure was already there, but she now has a fourth outfit so she will never get bored. Um, for Stevie did I change? All I did was change Stevie's top and I put those boots on her as well actually because I really like them. I don't think I changed anything else and I definitely didn't change anything for Lucas so we are good to go with this. So before she goes to work I'll just make sure everyone's needs are okay um, and that Ruby has done her homework because she never does it on her own. I always have to make her. And usually she starts and then does it for like two minutes and yeets onto something else. So we need to make sure she does it if if her needs are good enough that she can do it tonight. But let's see. These loading screens are really long for me now and I don't know really why. So let's see, what does she need? She's actually pretty good. So maybe actually you can clean that up for us and do your homework perfect what's wrong with stevie she needs sleep i actually got one of those posters um that you can get from the microscope so we're going to pop that down here i love these they just look so nice now eventually what we want to do is maybe extend this room because there's going to be a lot of stuff that stevie can put in here when she retires because um, we kind of want this to be like the room that has all of our career stuff in it. So once she retires, we'll extend that room and make sure all her stuff's down there. So let's get her new... She actually only really needs to eat and go to sleep, so... 
Let's do that real quick. Um, this is her room here. What about Lucas? He's pretty good too, actually. He does a shower. So let's make him go to one of the upstairs ones so that him and Ruby don't run into each other. What is it they don't like down here? It's this plate, right? Is this an outdoor bin? Yes, it is. Perfect. Why are you choosing... <sighs> this is like pure Sims logic at work. It's in the middle of winter. It's freezing. And instead of sitting in one of the two tables, they have two, right, that they could eat at. She could technically eat at this. She has a dining table. She has two couches and a chair and she chooses to go outside and eat in the snow. Why is this a thing? She doesn't even look happy about it. She looks miserable. Go inside if you're cold. Oh, okay. Never mind. So she's doing her homework. He's taking a shower out. Let's not spy on him. I think he's kind of ready for bed after that. He doesn't have anything to do for his career anymore because he's level 10. So I tend to not bother with the daily tasks. What I might do after we've got Stevie to work is re- Oh no, in fact, we could just do this now. I was going to say, we could redecorate this room. We've not... Does I just... I was going to say, I sold his guitar, but he's never literally never played it since we moved in. So does it really matter? Um, let's get them a new bed. Now, I love this one, but does it come? Mm, no. It's kind of hard to even tell what's mint anymore from staring at so many different colours of... That's cute. From looking at so many different colours of blue and green, I'm like, what even is mint at this point? Let's get them some little bedside tables. I don't know what would work best with this. I love these ones, but they're so small. And the issue with the actual Maxis ones is that they're all enormous. Um, no. I love these as well. But they look really small too. I could move them in. Let's put cheeks on. Move objects. Okay. Why don't we try these? That looks kind of cute. They're very small though, but... You know what? We'll go with that. We'll go with that. What do we want plant-wise in here? Mm. Do we like that? Yeah, I kind of do like that. And then here, I'm just going to do a lamp. It's kind of dark in their room for some reason. I think it's because it's a cold colour. So let's get a lamp on the go. This one is so bright. Let's go for that. Now, rug-wise, I'm happy with the size of this rug and where it is, but maybe there's a better... I think that's better. This mirror, I feel like, makes everything look too cold, so I'm going to go for... And let's get rid of that random one there that makes no sense. Um, I'm going to go for the floor one, you know, the one, but I do have recolours of it. Oh... So let's go for that one. I'm actually going to get rid of this computer altogether because they, they don't use it at all. So I could maybe put like a dressing table for her in here. I just saw one. Is it in here? Um, yeah, okay. So let's give her one of these. Because they don't use the computer at all. So there's literally no point in having it there. What chair would you use for this? I want like a, a comfy one and a nice colour. Maybe this one, that looks comfy. Do they have good colours? Yes, they do. Does this look really weird having one pink chair in here? I just really like it in pink. No, I kind of like that. I'm going to get rid of these Love Day cards because they've been up here since they moved in, to be honest. Um, let's get some makeup going on. Or this table. This can just be where Stevie gets dressed. Now I'm going to have to... Can I just ping you here? No, I cannot. Okay, let's try again. Is that too far out now? No, perfect. No, it kind of isn't even out far enough, is it? Um, perfect. 
perfect okay so she has her makeup station here now um, I want to get a plant going in that corner. Let's get rid of these. We don't need these anymore. Maybe keep keep the laptop in case one of the kids goes to university. Or we could just give it to... If we next see Radley, we could give it to him as a gift, couldn't we? Can I put this out somewhere? And then... Where can I put this? Just so that they can put it in their inventory. Let's put it down there just now. Um, beautiful. All I want really is a plant for this corner and then I think we are good to go. Um, yes. Do you have white? Yes you do. Beautiful. So they've got their wardrobes. That kind of... Hmm. I didn't realise that was so far away. Let's move that in a bit. And maybe we just have one of these. In a better colour. That'll do. And where are the kids' birth certificates? They were in their room at one point, but I did move them. But to where is the question? Shit. Oh, there, 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 there. Let's move these back in here. And we'll put these above. That's kind of cute, right? One for each child. Um, Lovely. Okay. Okay, so <clears throat> they've now pretty much all had room makeovers. That seems like a little bit more cozy. I don't really want to change the walls, but is there a nicer colour? This is a nice brick one. We could darken that. Oh, what about like a darker colour? I actually think I like the brick more. Mm, that's kind of too dark. Let's go for like this colour but in brick. I think that looks so cute. Okay. So let's just fast forward here. We want them all to go to bed. I'll probably just skip this and then catch up again in the morning. Ruby's just going to do her homework I think and go to bed. She can get her hunger up and her nearly put her to bed in the treadmill because I'm so used to her sleeping in there. Stevie's in her bed. Okay, great. Get out of there, please. Go to your own room. You go to your own room. Ruby, go to your own room. Excellent. Okay, so I'm just going to fast forward through this and then in the morning we'll catch back up when Stevie's off to work. Okay, we have everyone awake. I just realised it's actually Saturday, so Stevie does not have work. What I might do then is I'm going to see if I can visit Radley and give him that laptop. So I've put that laptop in Stevie's inventory, so we'll do that. And then potentially we'll get Ruby out on a date. So she has to go on two dates as part of her aspiration and she's already been on one. So let's actually focus on that next and we can maybe catch up with Radley later on. We're at 9am, let's see if he is awake. Can we invite him here and then we'll ask on a date? He will be right over. Delightful. Now, this is probably not the best outfit for the weather outside. So let's change her into... I mean, they're all not great. Let's change her into this because then at least she has long sleeves on. Oh, he's red as well. Okay, let's kiss hands. Hello, hello. Can I ask you on a date, sir? Yes, I can. Beautiful. I actually think they're... Okay, great. Definitely didn't mean that. I want to do this. I actually think they're pretty cute together. It upsets me that she's going to need to cheat on him like seven times. But needs must. Okay, so this is the custom save file that I'm playing in, so there's a lot of really cool areas nearby. So we have a tavern and a poker club, perhaps not the, the right age for that. Three pubs in the one little square. Feels UK looking at this. Um, let's go to this coffee shop, so Hair and Hedgehog. Let's just go inside first, we don't, don't want to be socialising out here. Now look how cute this cafe is. All of these builds are just ugh, 
I love this save file. I'm sure it's the one I linked in the last video. However, if I'm wrong, please accept my apologies whoever created it because I love it so much. So let's go in here so that we're not like outside in the cold. Now we need to socialise with them, so discuss some interests. Warn about bed safety, just in case he dies in it. Um, hug lovingly, brighten his day. And then maybe we should order some coffee. However, does no one work here? Where are all the people who work here? Do you work here? Oh, you do? Could you go behind there? Christian? Can we just order? You know, let's order four here. And we'll do Barista's recommendation, even though he's literally standing there doing absolutely nothing. And then we can make a He can't get behind there. Can I edit this real quick and just take this off so he can get in there? Does this work? I just want my latte. For here. Oh no, it was a barista's recommendation, right? Okay, he can get behind there now. We're good, we're good. Everyone else is going behind there. But. Are they ordered? What just happened? Who are you? Who is this? Are you good? Leanne? Oh, I knew I could hear an alien. Oh, she's so cute. Carly? Just give me my coffee. This one's a little unusual. Oh. Looks like a, a ristretto. What be you? Um, where can we sit? Apparently we're sitting over here. Okay. Let's sit together. Because we need to get some more interactions done. Alexander, hello. Oh, okay, great. You just sit next to other bitches, that's fine. Let's tell a joke about aliens while there's an alien nearby. Maybe she'll hear us. Abductors. Now you move! Oh. oh my god. Thank you. Yeah, no. Let's exchange promise rings. Even though we know. We know what's about to go down. Where are you? Betty. Betty Newby? That's... Is that the Newby family? Was it Betty and Bob, right? Who is this? No, not you. Adam Bradford? What a handsome man. And we're stuck with poor Alexander. Let's come complain about our parents even though they're nice but he doesn't know that. obsess over favorite celebrity or we have to have a deep conversation where are you there could you just leave this car how long does it take you to drink a cup of coffee oh my god deep conversation he is literally talking to this betty bitch instead of speaking to us and she's sitting with her legs wide open, like what in the name of the baby Jesus is happening? <sighs> is that? Yes, it is, Jeffrey. Look at that moustache. Hey! Should we take pictures of them while we're on a date? If people kept, like, could keep their faces away from looking by. You don't look that happy. This doesn't look like a happy date, right? He looks kind of mad. She looks done with him. Okay, we need to flirt. We can do that. Compliment his appearance. She's, she doesn't seem that into him. I think she's actually bored by him. She is. I'm really not at all surprised. It's Ruby. Did I tell her to do that? I'm fairly certain I didn't tell her to do that, but okay. 
Hey, oh, I just did that, but okay. Would you like another one, sir? She's like literally not his friend at all, but they have max romance. Beautiful. Can I end this now? Yes. Fantastic. There we go. So she needs three first kisses. Are you trying to tell me? Oh wait, no, we did it before. You know what? We're fine. Let's just exchange promise rings. I'm sure it's some. There's Stevie. Hey. Oh. Let's vent to her. Maybe she's going to be like, Ugh, I'm bored of this guy already, Mum. What do I do? Share a secret. Okay, it's snowing outside. What are you doing? So I gave Ruby the laptop and we're going to take it over and visit her brother. I don't know if I decorated his home, so it's quite possible that he lives in an empty house. So here he is and this is his new house, which is pretty cute. So hello bro. Secret handshake. We're going inside. I have to knock on his door when he's out here. Could you go in your house and like? Oh my god, it isn't. Okay, so let's pretend he's outside waiting for his furniture to be delivered. In fact, I know exactly what house this is. This is the house that Stevie started in. This was Stevie's first house, and I would never have recognised it if it wasn't for that wallpaper. This was her first house, and then when she had Radley. So she used to have a little built-in wardrobe here and obviously her stuff was in here. That was her teeny tiny little kitchen and her living room is here somewhere I believe. And she had, I wish I'd kept a picture, her little bathroom. This was Radley and Ruby's room. So now you understand why they didn't have computers, it was so tiny. But they stayed in this house for so long, like she was in here when she met Lucas, they got married living in this house. Oh, I really didn't know that's where I'd moved them. But now I kind of love it. Maybe when Stevie left, she didn't sell it. She kept it like in the family. And when Radley said he, he wanted to move, she was like, well, don't tell your sister, but you can have this house. Now, can I give him this laptop? Give him a friendly gift. Yes, I can. So at least he'll have a laptop. Yay! So maybe this is just like a quick visit. We're here to be like... Love your new place. Hope your furniture gets delivered soon. Mum bought you this laptop. See you later. Okay, so she needs to pee really bad. Go pee. And then if you could mop the floor, that would be perfect. Really don't piss yourself. Go to the toilet. Look at Lucas. He's so old now. Aww. Go get your dinner. Stevie's still at that coffee shop by herself. We'll just leave her there. Aww, he's so old. Is there anything else she needs to do? She needs to eat. Maybe. Does, does Ruby know anyone else her own age? She knows Laurie. Let's invite Laurie over. We're going to make friends with her, and maybe more. She'll be right over. Perfect. Hey! Um, let's brighten her day. I do not know where she met this lady. I'm assuming it was at school. Share photos. She's talking to her dad. Let's take a photo with her. Oh, let's take a photo with our dad too. That would be so cute. Take photo with Lucas. She doesn't even stand up to say hello to someone who just came into our house. She's like, hey. Oh, Stevie in the background. Did she just take a picture of her? Did you even ask? Strange lady. Let's take a picture, girl. Oh, that's cute. Look at her eyelashes, though. Oh, in fact, 
Okay, let's take five. I usually just take five, pick the best, and then sell the rest. I downloaded some eyelashes. Food menu. Cannot do this, but oh, she's taking a picture with her daddy. Not the weird daddy, like her actual dad. Oh, I don't know why I've never done this before. They have like no family pictures. There we go. But I don't know if that'll work. Oh, look, here's the new eyelash. Wow, okay. Rude. I clearly forgot some kind of mesh for these. So that's great. Did I download any other ones? Yes, I did. So these are the Leah Lilith ones. These are actually pretty cute. I feel like you would have to wear eyeliner with these though, right? Like, let me put some eyeliner on and see if that looks better. Yes, it does. Oh, they are actually so nice. I love them. These are so nice. They're so wispy. Oh, cute. I don't remember what- I don't think I downloaded anything else, really. These are the eyelashes I usually use, so those are by Plumbob Juice. I've never used these ones before. But I really like these ones, actually. I think these are my favourite. Where are the super giant- Ooh. I was going to say, where are the giant ones that are in the thumbnail? But that's them right there, right? I'm going to actually give her the giant ones. I think those are cute. Okay, she has her beautiful new eyelashes. Now, where did that girl go? Is she still here? Yes, she is. She's about to go on the computer, no doubt, for ages so that we can't speak to her. Um, let's ask her about her career as a teen. Compliment her outfit, even though it's not great. But she doesn't have to know that. Show off your own outfit. Don't look. My new boots, my new eyelashes. Boast about messing around. Why not? Let's do that and then flirt with her and see what happens. Um, let's do a bold pickup line. I feel like Ruby would be quite confident, lady. Oh, she's in there. She's in there. Let's ask her if she's single. If she's not, we don't care. We're not usually about that life, but. Maybe I'll see you. I'm seeing someone. You're about to be seeing someone else as well. What the fuck is that? Is that a potato? Oh, <laughs> that's a lump of clay. I thought it was a baked potato. I was like, why have you brought this here? Um, let's go flirt with her some more. She's like really annoyed. She's hungry. She's having no fun. She's tired, but needs must. Uh, Let's brighten her day as well. Ooh. She's in a her. Let's do first kiss. Did it happen? Aww. Let's get a picture of this. Gonna need to remember all these people, you know? So it's so weird trying to get like you realize how strange like a sim player is sometimes when you're playing this game and you have the camera like right in people's faces to take pictures and then you realize what you're doing and you're like why have I done this but you know we need the screenshot oh she looks horrified do we want to ask her to be our girlfriend <laughs> now you can go eat. So I think what we'll do, we could leave it here and then what do we want to do with them tomorrow then? We might skip, so I might leave it here then skip Sunday so I'll really just have them doing more of the same like make sure their needs are up. Ruby's already done her homework so it's fine. She could maybe work on a skill. Um, I think she plays games a lot so maybe she'll play some games. Maybe she'll hang out with Laurie or Alexander. And then we'll pick back up when Stevie goes to work. Hopefully we'll get her to level 9 and then we only have one left before we can focus on Ruby full time. So let's do that and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!